now that you have confirmation from the people that you're going to be interviewing, it's time to come up with some questions. So your question flow overall should function like a sandwich with the easier questions as the bread in both the beginning and the end of your interview, where the tougher, more difficult, but ultimately more meaningful and flavorful questions will be in the middle. The thing is, you need to tailor your questions so they specifically match the person that you're interviewing. Yes, this means looking into their bio and seeing what previous work they did if you didn't do so already in your research and looking for people to interview. You want to make sure that this interview is as personal as possible. That being said, here's a tip. Avoid asking questions that are yes or no. Because the thing is, those questions aren't super complex. And Student Cam is looking for documentaries that show a lot of in-depth analysis about significance, not just facts and figures that you can look up online, but why the topic matters, why the audience should care about it. So ask questions instead of who, what, and where. Ask questions as to how and why. Ask questions leading with those phrases. So by beginning with those, you kind of pose a new argument of looking more into the significance and the importance of an event and why it really matters. And that ultimately is what Student Cam is about, looking at issues and seeing why they matter in the first place and why we should be aware of them and what steps we can do to become more aware of them or even take actions for or against them. So I hope this video helped you. If you have any other questions, be sure to email at educate at cspan.org and there you can get more tips and information on really how to pose your interview questions. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. <laughs>